Super Saiyan God? What? Okay, let's get going. You can't provoke me, but you can get my last wish. Oh no, spooky. I voted for Obama too ironically. Oh, good. Jeez. Remember your What? What are you staring at? I am Gohan. Impossible! What? Don't get yourself too excited landing a blow on me! Yeah, I don't. What what happened now? I gotta actually look. Well, <laughs> British is back. Let's see. Yeah, please, let's pick a topic. Uh, he's doing it on purpose. Mitt Romney is my favorite pilot politician. Ah, uh, typo. So, game key. How was your evening? M Perpetual. My evening is great, man. All right, next time it's a ban. F and bomb just. Just use the long timeouts. That's that's basically what I'm suggesting here, because in the end we could have like a uh, like a troll night and a promotion night. Is what I'm con uh, getting ready to be looking at, and I would like a uh, horse to be a part of troll night, where basically we can get together. And you guys can, basically it'll be a hate night. You guys can hate, 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 hate all y'all want. And uh, then we can have our promotion night where, thanks to Doc Got Game, the idea came about. And it is freaking awesome. Freaking awesome. Basically, uh, he's giving everyone like one hour. Whoever you are, uh, if you're a new streamer, artist, illustrator, web designer, uh, any of that, basically, uh, you get one hour to promote yourself. You get like three, four sentence, promote your channel or your, you know, your YouTube or your, uh, your page with all your artwork and your looksies on it, you know, something. As long as it's not R-rated or X-rated, anything like that uh, can get you uh, banned, like, you know, banned from the channel for a day. But, however, like, uh, basically a free promotion tool. 
because it's understandable how streamer other streamers are. They do not like you promoting in other channels. They do not like you promoting in their channel, especially while they are streaming. Um, I had the I've had as a new streamer, I've had the unfortunate outcome of experiencing this. You know, hey, don't do this, or getting completely ignored. Um, like with Co Carnage, I went through the facts. I totally skipped over the fact about promoting myself in his channel. I was just like, hey, you could, uh, if you wanted to take part, just say yes or no. Uh, I completely understand, considering you've made it. I didn't realize he had 5,000 subscribers. Um, the coolest dude ever um, that got me into watching Co Carnage is Burke Black. Oh my goodness. So like that's this is where my inspiration comes, guys. Like new new streamers, people who've already made it. These guys, uh, oh my goodness, what did British do? Oh, well, rest in poop, horse, you nerd. Rest in prosperity, tile. Brett, behave yourself. Rest in porn. What's up with all the trolls today? Trolls are coming on all day. Yeah, like, basically the trolls could get this out of their system. But, again, like I said, uh, Doc Got Game gave the greatest thing ever, which was promoting yourself for like an hour to two hours in stream live. Didn't even matter who you were. If you were a big streamer, a little streamer, new to Twitch, who's, who's never been here before, it was like, okay, let's do this. So... Let's continue on and try and get Z. If you want a shout out, you can do dropped frames. Barely any trolls on Crow's channel, but there's there's more talent. Boom. Yeah. What was your rank in the USMC? Uh, I made it to Corporal, bro, as the E4. How can you beat us I'm the strongest on earth. Yeah. Nice. All right, guys. Come on. Ah, wrong thing. There we go. So we made it. I can just send you I can send you via Twitch message or Steam if you have one the link. Corporal? No way. Not this guy. <laughs> uh no, seriously guys though. Uh I had a lot of fun with the Marine Corps. Um I was with a good group of guys. I did reserves for six years. Um, currently, I'm on my two-year inactive uh, ready reserve contract, but that ends in June. They aren't calling me back. They've sent me a lot of emails like, hey, do you, if you want to come back, this is the route you're going to go. I don't want to go back. I got my military benefits. That was the whole point of me joining. Get that military benefit. Get into college. I'm in college. I don't need the military life no more. It, it, I've already got a full, I've got a full family. I need to focus on that education and getting that G-O-B, guys. So, yeah. Um, I was going to, like, make a career out of it. And then things got really hard, like, uh, my second year in. And then people hated on myself and my career interests. And it just seemed like it was a bunch of haters. It was like Marine Corps Haters Club edition. And, uh... I just I got out before the hating became like loss of everything and dishonorment. I just I would have killed somebody at some point. 
And it wouldn't have been like, oh, okay, he shot, you know, an Iraqi or something or, you know, did a mission or something like that. No, I would have shot the people I was working with because that's how ridiculous it got. Um, it, it was just, uh, hmm, OP pranking. That's, that's the best way I can describe it. It was extremely violent. I'm becoming a Sergeant Major of the Marine Corps. Well... Perpetual Gamer Z, you, I wish you good luck, my friend. You have yourself a good time in the military, in the Marine Corps. Like I said, send me that Twitch message. Let me know where you're going to boot camp and let me know your graduation date. I will gladly come to your graduation, bro. So, um, it, it wasn't like all that bad, honestly. Um, I'm exaggerating quite a bit. I just had a really rough time with the guys I was with. There wasn't like a sense of like, uh, like you know, sky's the limit type of deal. Um, basically, every turn we made to succeed and promote ourselves and do ourselves any better, um, we kept getting hit with, oh, the Marine Corps doesn't have money. You can't go to martial arts school. You can't go get your black belt. You can't go be an instructor. Oh, all of you want to be instructors. Let's send you to school. They're going to fail you anyway. And... It just got ridiculous. Like, it was an instructor-by-instructor instructor basis. Like, eh, we just, we're going to fail the class this time. Oh, these guys don't look like they're trying hard enough. Uh, these guys don't want to be here. And as the saying goes, perpetual, that you'll learn, one, just one, one guy screws it up for hundreds, hundreds of people. And that's how all of these programs work. Um... I wish you the best of luck, my friend. So, here in Finland, it's mandatory to serve at least 180 days in the Army. Dude, effing bomb. I wish everyone kind of, like, had to deal with that. 180 days? Dude, that's fucking cakewalk. That's, that's what, six months? You know, that's three months of... 13 weeks of training, which is like three months, and then the rest of it's going into your job school, and then you're like, oh, okay, now you're worth all this money, and oh, well, now your time's up. Kind of like that. What I mean by like one guy screws it up for everyone, like, okay, you're in your job school, okay. You graduate, you know, now you have your job, your MOS, you know, as you want to call it. And, uh, hey, I want to be an instructor. I want to be a black, I want to be a martial arts instructor. Okay, we're going to send you. You look like you want to go. You've busted your butt on your deployments. You're, you're going. You know, you, you've you been earning your belts, too, while you've been on these deployments. You're making us look good. The unit looks great. You know, you're that guy. Everyone should look up to you. And then they're like, um, well, we don't have the money, so, well, you can't go. And then, like, uh, other times, all right, we've got a class of 200 people here. All these guys want to be instructors. Let's weed out the weaklings. You'll go through, you know, people who can't hack the program. They'll get knocked out eventually. You know, they'll either injure themselves or they'll, like, not make the cut um, through the testing. And, you know, they take the best of the best. However, when they're just like, none of you guys are taking this seriously. This is just a joke to you guys. Everyone, you're going home. That's when you're like, are you serious? Are you serious, bro? Like, we spent all this time, my unit gave me one chance, and now you're sending us all home because you guys don't want to train us. That's the, pro that's the problems I looked at. Those were the problems I faced. Um, so, man, you have yourself a good time. I've got friends who are still in. They're making a lifetime commitment out of it. I salute them, guys. Oh, my God, what did Burke Black pull out of a box? What the hell is that? I'm actually curious. He's got my attention. What did Burke get? It's so freaking heavy. Oh, it's a giant gummy bear gummy bear. What the heck? That's insane. Anyway.
<laughs> um, but yeah, it's it's just been uh, a lot of cool times, man. Loot crate. What? Is that this month's loot crate? I won't get mine till the twentieth. Anyway, um, it's been a really fun time with you guys. I had a lot of fun today, considering I don't have a lot of time for this. I don't have a lot of time for this on Mondays or Wednesdays. Um, I have two major tests coming up, so tomorrow is unfortunately going to be cut short because I'm going to be writing out a study guide and studying the crap out of it for a test first thing Wednesday morning. So... Bear with me, guys. It's just this week. And on Thursday, I am done at 3 in the afternoon. I go on spring break. So basically, the week after this is all spring break. But because my weekend starts on Thursday, I have like, what, one, two, like, like two and a half extra days or a day and a half extra, something like that, which is amazing. I'm excited. So horse, British, effing bomb, tarot master, a Wild West, so if you're still here, Real Grim Reaper, if you're still here, guys, it has been an awesome time. So let's start that giveaway. Let's start it. Come on. Let's see. We are going into the game vault and reaching out for... Wait for it. A new pair of pants. No, I'm kidding. Um... Ah. <coughs> All right. That's it. Uh that's that's Hey guys, uh stay for the raffle. Whoa. There we go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We forgot to set the ticket. There we go. There we go. Look at that. Nailed. Donated by me, Game K. Yeah. Get those tickets in. You guys got five minutes. Five minutes. So, guys, you can put in up to 2,000 tickets. Get them in. Get them in. Uh, these games are, it's exclamation ticket space X. So, even though if I win, I'm going to re-roll it. It'll be like uh, exclamation ticket, you know, five. Something like that. Oh, okay. There you go. Oh, my God. Let's see. Uh, a wild wesso. Just so you know, you have almost fourteen hundred uh, game cartridges, bro. That's like um, like I can look at all of your guys's game cartridges, and you guys all have a lot of game cartridges, minus perpetual and British, because they've been putting in for a lot of stuff. <laughs> uh, YOLO Like British and Effin' Bomb You guys are almost at a thousand So Do y'all's things YOLO swag You chugging all of them in <laughs> My big mug of coffee Also guys Check this out We might be doing something for uh Oh, shoot. I can't remember the name of the charity. Oh, uh, Wounded Warriors. That's it. That group is awesome. Taking the random luck on a single ticket win because, uh... Yeah, dude. I know what you mean. One ticket YOLO swag for the win. 
Yeah, I thought this was cool, guys. Be a hero. Help a hero. Uh, yeah, Wounded Warrior Project, it's it's close to me. I got to work with that project uh, right at, uh, during boot camp and directly after. Um, the really coolest thing was I met probably some of the coolest dudes who didn't look like you or me. Um, you know, deformities, burns, mass scarring, loss of an ear, eyes, that kind of stuff. I probably met some of the coolest dudes in the Wounded Warrior Project, um, even to this day. Uh, they may be watching on Twitch, lurking and whatnot from time to time, or they just may not even have an account. They just may be watching. So, uh, I know they... We used to email back from time to time. Um, these guys keep in touch usually just by watching sh shit on YouTube. They watch anything I have on YouTube usually, um, which is the coolest thing. Because then every now and then I'll get the random email like, Hey, dude, caught your show. Saw this was cool. And, like, they'll ask how I've been. Stuff like that. It's really neat. Oh, jeez. Yeah, British. Yeah. But it's it's something I, I take personally because uh, these are some of the toughest guys and they sacrificed. Um, whether it was one side or the other, you know, these guys sacrificed for a war that's not chosen by them. And I look at it on both sides. So. All right. Come on, guys. You have less than a minute. Get those tickets in. Oh, my goodness. Effing bomb for a 1,000 tickets? You really want this game, bro. And then British dropping 700 like, pff, boss. Bloody hell, mate. <laughs> Lost it. Lost it. Remember, guys, this is uh, via Steam, and we'll be doing this every night. Um, these past few nights, I've literally seen, like, one person in here. I'm not about to do a raffle for one guy. Just, nah. All right, Taro, you have a good night, man. And raffle is over. The winner is... Bum, 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 bum. Evan Bomb with his 1,000 tickets. Oh, my goodness. I was kind of expecting someone else to win that, just so you know. Hey, Evan Bomb, hit me up on Steam in the Game Key Games group, bro. Look at that. You've been following the stream, like, almost exactly on my birthday. You were two days before my birthday, bro. That's freaking cool. You're almost there. I wonder who made it on my birthday. I wonder if I can see that. Oh, wait. Nope. 20th of February. My bad. Three days after my birthday. F and bomb. Do I have you as a friend on uh, Steam? He got nailed. N a i l. Uh, when did I follow GameKey? When? When? Perpetual. You've been following me since since the twelfth of March. Yeah, 12th of March. That's that's currently what I see. Um, if the dates are off, that's just because you unfollowed and followed. Um, also, if you haven't unfollowed and followed, which I can see a lot of it, like British, uh, you'd have to do it, but I know you're following. Um, while Wesso, you're good. 
effing bomb, you'd have to do it again just so it'll pick up on the bot. Grim's fine. Hey, look, there's a me hat guy. How are you, me hat? You're just like chilling in the background. Huh. Well, he's not there anymore. Uh, F and bomb. Send me a friends request or join me in the Game Key Games group, bro. <laughs> You've unfollowed several times by accident. Yeah, unfollowed, followed. One new invite. Hmm. Block. Did I just hear that right? Yeah. Wow. My wife's watching a Robin Williams movie. Drop frame link? Uh, sure. Perpetual? Uh, bam. <laughs> Here I am. This is me effing. You can give me the game now. <laughs> I see you British. <laughs> Uh, that's funny. Send gift! Send! Send my gift directly through Steam! Where are you effing? You won, bro. You won. <laughs> there you go, man. There you go. All right, guys. This is Game Key Games. I had a fun night, guys. Let's go hit up our dear friend Burke Black with the host. And we shall raid him. Actually, let's get ready for the raid right now. Let's do that. Let's game raid him, guys. It'll look like this. Uh, babe, what's the name of this movie? It's a Robin Williams. Uh, The Angriest Man in Brooklyn. Wow. Didn't know, uh... Let's game raid Burke Black. Let's game raid him, guys. Let's go, 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 Raiders. Go. Well, here we go. I'm going to host him. And you guys go raid. <laughs> I 
think then, Kaz, we'd be even about you stealing my my boots. <laughs> yeah, save it for TwitchCon. There you go. I'll spray it on. Uh, <laughs> if I can get him, I'll spray a little bit on uh, on on Co or Ello's finger, so that when they go up, you know, rub their nose. <laughs> oh man.